If you ever needed to deactivate a particular marketplace for a product, then what you could do is just click into the product and once you're inside the product settings, scroll down to where it says retail pricing and SKUs and you can see the marketplaces and you can just delete one here. Uh, if you accidentally delete one, um, you can just add it back in here like that. So that's one way to do it. You can also group by region up here. Since we're at this point, I might as well tell you that. So if you're sending inventory to the United States, but you're in the NARF program, which is North America Remote Fulfillment, you can group by North America. And what that means is that this will show up as one inventory level for all three of those because you're not actually sending inventory to these three different countries. You're just fulfilling to those two countries using the US inventory. So that's how you remove this marketplace on a product level. The other way you can do it is if you go to settings and then you go to connected to Amazon store, you can actually turn off different marketplaces here. And if it gives you this warning, it says you have one purchase order and one work order currently open for this marketplace. By removing the marketplace, we'll delete these as well. Are you sure you want to do this? Um, obviously you choose yes or cancel. So that's how you would turn off those marketplaces.